Hello again guys, um, I'm going to do a pot belly pig style fly today, it's going to be sort of pink, yellow and silver, um, it will look like that guy there, and to tie this you're going to need a yellow cocker hen hackle, um, this is sort of deep pink uh, hackle, uh, this is a hen. Um, you need some fluorescent pink or just pink um, boar bristles for the tail. Um, you need some silver flash. Um, using this uh, silver body dubbin, um, you need a pink bucktail. Um, jungle cock and you will need some silver wire and the last thing for the head is a extra small pearl or mylar tinsel so this black thread already went to the back and go in with a little bit of wire for the butt so it'll be one two three four and on the fifth one tuck under and just trim away because there's no I don't bother with a rib on this one either. Um, we come in. Actually, yeah, you need this as well. It's um, holographic tinsel, flat tinsel. And it just forms a small section of the rear body up to where you put the first pink hackle in. So I'll be about halfway roughly. Just dab a tiny bit of super glue on there. Tie that off a bit there. So then we come in with the rear hackle. So on and it's quite quite long fibres on it. And this is the pink the pink one. Again tie in from the tip right there. And that it's almost got a bit of flamethrower style to this. So you went, I don't know, maybe three turns, four turns, do one more. Tie it off. And with that hackle tied like that, it's going to give a nice base for the tail to sit on. So we'll just tie these back. There we go. So they're all facing backwards nicely. And that's when we come in with a few strands. Don't want to go mad with it here. Just a few strands of pink bucktail to form the tail. So 
There we go. So. See what that's like. Yeah, that's good. I'll have that. So that's the basic shape. So onto that goes a doubled strand of silver flash. Yeah, and then on top of that, we go with the pink board bristles. So I just go in with my finger, just run it over like that to give it a bit of curl. And I position them one at a time, find it easier. There's one, it goes in same length as the tail. On the other side. Just that sitting. Yep, that's sitting fine. And then cut away the loose ends. So that's the ear done. Then take a small pinch silver dubbin. Dub it on, it's really good stuff this. Dump the front of the fly. Right there's probably enough. Just some of that. And then we'll come in find a nice yellow hacker to finish that off. find one. There we go. It's a fly I've been asked for. Um, honestly, I haven't fished it myself. Um, it does look, it looks really good. Um, you can imagine it'd be good in coloured water. Maybe in the spring as well. So just two or three tons. The yellow hackle at the front. And tie that off. And it's not sitting right, just just gently tease it backwards. Yeah, that looks fine. Um now the last two steps of this fly is a couple of jungle cock feathers either side. Fold that over, tie it in, not lock it in place. Just 
just match it to the other side. Away the waist. And then to finish the flight, come in with the pearl UV. Oh, it's not UV, sorry, the pearl flat tinsel. Just catch it right in at the tip. Small but super glue. That's better. Which means you can take your time fill off. And can finish. Finish with the head. And then finishing touch to the fly as usual, just a little bit of varnish. So, this is the UV varnish. Just take the fly out. the torch again Back in there for you to have a look at. And there we go. Pink and yellow PBP pot belly pig. Looks very nice. Cheers. Bye bye.